this is Stampy, and welcome to a Minecraft Let's Play video. Today I am doing another challenge, and um, as you can see, this is going to be um, a little bit of a weird one right now. Uh, you might assume I am playing with someone else, uh, because I'm playing in split screen. But no, this is uh, this is just me. <laughs> this is the the double trouble challenge, and at the moment I'm sitting here with two controllers in front of me. One controls Stampy Long Nose, and the other one controls another Stampy Long Nose, or Stampy Long No One, <laughs> as the uh, the game tag seems to, to to say. And I am playing against, if I come out here two ballistic squids <laughs> and so the challenge is is that we need to control both characters at the same time or at least uh, take turns uh, very quickly uh, who we're controlling and so the reason we need to do that is because this character the top screen uh, player one is allowed to mine blocks and uh, they're also allowed to battle googlies and then the other character uh, over here uh, is allowed uh, to craft uh, as well as placing blocks so it's kind of similar uh, to the uh, the, to uh, the together challenge uh, if you saw that apart from I'm not really doing it together with someone I'm kind of just doing it together with myself and I can already tell this is going to be very difficult so <laughs> uh, we're yet to, to see how this is uh, going to go and the challenge is if you look at the uh, the top screen for a second, uh, is to make a cookie, a minecart with TNT in it, as well as a flower pot with a dead bush in it. And uh, a dead bush is uh, one of these things down here. Uh, but you need uh, shears to, to gather them. And so yeah, we need to do that while trying to control uh, both our characters and going around to, together. Because you could kind of wander off with just one by itself. Uh, but yeah, that wouldn't really help you out very much because if you need to mine or craft, you kind of need uh, both of them to, together. So uh, that's exactly uh, what we are going to, to be doing. And I'm already dreading uh, what we've got ourselves into because I can tell that this is going to be extremely difficult. So uh, challenge number one, uh, let's try and get both characters to bed if we can. Let's try and get inside the house or one's in. <laughs> it is so hard looking at both characters, I tell you. Right, uh, let's go and just shut the, the door. And uh, first things, uh, let's go and grab all of our items. So I have been quite nice and I've got a bunch of uh, items uh, inside of this chest here. And as uh, seen as this is the, the character that's allowed to, uh, to mine, I guess they should have all of the uh, the tools. Oh, but they're not allowed to place the, the torches down, are they? So if I go and uh, throw uh, all of the uh, the torches to the other character here, uh, they can be in charge with uh, placing them down. And then in the uh, the other chest, uh, we have a, a whole load of fish. Uh, you can see we have uh, two pairs of the, uh, the fish here, as well as two golden apples. So this character uh, grabs all of these ones, and then this character can go and grab uh, all of the, uh, the rest. Uh, we should be uh, ready to, to begin. So for the first time ever in one of the, the challenges, I have two beds in the, uh, the house. <laughs> uh, one for me, and uh, one for my, uh, my stampy twin. So uh, as soon as it's morning, uh, the, uh, the challenge is going to, to begin. So uh, I guess I should uh, decide uh, what I want to go for first. Oh, I think the most important thing is going to be the, the cookie. Uh, because for the cookie, uh, you need uh, to have wheat, uh, which means I'm going to even need to get very lucky uh, and find a... Um uh, a farm, uh, but a better option and a, a more reliable option uh, would be to set up my own wheat farm. So I think if I go and set up the uh, the wheat farm first and just leave that growing, uh, then uh, hopefully I can just come back later on and I can go and uh, try and uh, grab the uh, the wheat. Right. So let's begin. The challenge has begun. Let's see <laughs> uh, how well I can uh, I can control. So I'm just kind of placing the um the controller down on the uh, the floor and uh, yeah, I'm just trying to control it that way. So. Uh, let me have a look around. I want to try and find some grass. Right. If I actually, if I leave uh, first, uh, this guy safely in the uh, the house, I can go and try and um, I can try and grab some seeds uh, and uh, try and grab some cocoa beans as well. Because this one's allowed to break blocks, I should be okay. It looks like Squid's left <laughs> his one standing here uh, as well. <laughs> so yeah, let's try and get some seeds uh, so I can grow some some wheat and uh, also get some cocoa beans because I can do this uh, all by myself. Seeing as I'm allowed the uh, to uh, break blocks and uh, we might 
uh, at some point accidentally do it the the wrong way round, and that just might happen it's going to be very confusing so if i get confused uh, then yeah just please don't tell me off so there we go i got some cocoa beans and i have a i have a few uh wheat seeds i'm going to go and grab uh, some more if, uh, if i can though uh, so let me go over here oh, and i could also uh, get some wood as well uh, a jungle is probably the uh, the best place to to get a lot of uh, uh, a lot of uh, the the trees so i can go and try and uh, break some of them down as well because uh, i'm probably going to need some later on for something or other oh yeah to make an iron pickaxe I'm going to need some sticks and to make more torches and things. So I'm going to also uh, try and grab some tree trunks uh, while I'm here. And uh, oh, another thing I could try and get is some clay as well, I guess. That's something that I uh, could get as well. But I think the biggest challenge uh, is probably uh, to get all of the, the iron that I need uh, to go down mining uh, like this. And ooh, some lava there. That could have been dangerous. And oh, is there any iron around here? Yeah, getting iron uh, going down to the mine uh, is probably going to be the uh, the most difficult part of it. But I've got some wheat here, uh, so I can do some uh, get some wheat growing. Uh, but I need to make a hoe first. And so to do that, I'm going to need uh, my other friend uh, to do the, the crafting for me. So if I go and uh, grab some stone and some wood, I can go and make myself a, a hoe. And then that way I can head back and I can start off a, a little farm. And I also want to try and make sure uh, that the farm isn't near to, to Squid Nugget, because uh, I do not want him going going and stealing any of uh, of my wheat. Uh, we do have the rule uh, that we are not allowed to attack each other. So even though uh, one of uh, uh, our people can attack Googlies, uh, I am not allowed to attack Squid. So it's going to be uh, a slightly more peaceful challenge than <laughs> uh, some of the uh, the previous ones have been. So uh, let's go and uh, grab a little bit of this stone because uh, that always comes in handy. And uh, let's go and uh, head home then, shall we? And I can go and uh, try and uh, set up my, uh, my wheat farm. I feel sorry for my other character. You can just see him uh, standing around there waiting for me at home by himself. <laughs> Let's go and try and bring him with him. But I think the, um, the less time that we spend uh, walking around together, the better, because that is when things are going to be very difficult and very slow. And uh, let me... Uh, let me, uh, yeah, uh, convince you that it is going to be very difficult to, to walk around together. So, and it's... Wait a minute, is Squid in... Oh, I was thinking that Squid's in my house, but of course he isn't. That's me, that's the other me. Yum, 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 yum. <laughs> Gonna eat some cake as well. Right then, uh, let's go and uh, try and make uh, a pickaxe then. So if I go and throw some wood to me, uh, then I can pick them up and let's go and uh, make a... I guess I can just make myself a, um, a wooden hoe. I don't need to, to waste any of the, the cobblestone at all. Didn't mean to do that. <laughs> that was bad. Right, let's go and uh, make some uh, some wooden sticks. And uh, then I can go and make myself a, a wooden hoe. And uh, yeah, let's go and um, let's go and cultivate the the land. I guess that I guess it would have to be this character, the bottom one, uh, that goes and does this. So uh, it'd be good to do it somewhere quite hidden. But I don't want to waste too much time. And uh, there doesn't seem to be much dirt around the water here. Let's go and try and uh, place it down here. And uh, hopefully Squid will be nice and not steal it. So if I go uh, along here like this. So uh, let's go and uh, try and uh, head to uh, a cave then, shall we? So uh, which way shall we go? There seems to be desert all the way around here. And then jungle in that direction. Let's go off in a, a different direction then, shall we? Uh, so let's head off in this direction. So I think the way I'm going to do this is if I watch my other character on the other screen, I can kind of control them both. So on the, the bottom screen, I am watching uh, the, the character moving and then trying to control that character while trying to control me at the, the same time. So it's not easy... Uh, not moving too slowly. Oh, oh walked into a cactus. <laughs> I don't really want to, to sprint uh, because I don't want to end up falling into a big hole or a lava or anything. I kind of need uh, to keep track. But overall, uh, I'm not doing uh, too badly here. And is that a cave in front of me? I don't know if it's going to be a little bit of a, a pit of water or an actual cave or something. Uh, but let's see if I can uh, make my way over to it. Here we go. Is this? Nope. Just another little pit of water. What's with these little pits of water? It's very pretty, uh, but not uh, very helpful. So let's go and uh, walk up this way. And oh, I'm kind uh, I'm, I'm ruining my tactic here. I need to, to make it so I can see myself. There we go. If I can see myself on the other screen, it's kind of easier to, to get your bearings and uh, work out where to uh, where everything is. Uh, let's look. Oh, maybe down that direction. Uh, if you see the uh, the top screen, uh, I think that might be a little cave down here. So let's go and head that way and uh, see if I can go and uh, find myself a, a little bit of a a little bit of iron. Is this uh, a good cave? Here we go. This looks like it's uh, a much better cave. Ah, it looks like it goes uh, quite deep as well. So let's wait for me to, to catch up <laughs> and let's go and uh, head down. So remember, this one is the one uh, that has to place all the, the torches. If I kind of send him down a little bit first and then switch between them. But remember, that one isn't allowed to attack any Goo 
ugly, so it's a little bit dangerous, but I kind of need to send it first uh, to go and place down the torches. And look at this cave. It is absolutely huge. So, um, oh, I can't place down any blocks as this one either, so I can't even build a little bit of a, a bridge to, to get to the iron. Let's go and uh, send this one down a little bit further. Uh, so we can hopefully uh, build a, a little bit of a, a bridge and uh, then help the other one get across. So let's go and pass some cobblestone to myself. It's so weird. It's so weird just having another stampy cat following me around. <laughs> it just looks odd, doesn't it? Right, let's go and uh, build a little bit here so uh, neither of me fall down. And uh, let's go and uh, gather up this iron. So I need quite a lot of iron. Uh, I need iron to um, uh, make the minecart. I also need it to make the shears, and it would be also be good to make a little bit of iron armor and an iron sword as well. And uh, the reason for that is because I also need to get gunpowder. And where do you get gunpowder from? Mm, creepers. So <laughs> I needed to be very careful uh, that I don't go um, uh, up against creepers and not be prepared, uh, because I do not want to, to get taken out. So getting uh, an iron uh, sword and maybe some iron armor uh, would be very helpful uh, as well. But luckily, I seem to be getting quite a lot of uh, iron uh, straight down here already. I haven't worked out how much I need so let's just go gather a whole bunch and then I can go and uh, head home and it'd be good to be back up on this surface uh, when it's night time because uh, that's going to be a good time uh, to go after all of the uh, the googly. So let's go and uh, I can kind of jump down in this uh, water here I think and then go and land down here. That wasn't too painful but remember if there are googlies down there uh, that one is not allowed to, to fight them so I want to be very careful and there we go uh, that was uh, a little bit more elegant and uh, the water uh, is really handy to uh, to get out of the cave, uh, all I need to do is I just go and swim up. Because remember, this character, the top one, he can't place blocks. So he is not going to be able to, to pile up blocks uh, to get out of here. The other one is going to have to build a little bit of a staircase. So let me go and see if there's any googlies. Uh, we seem to actually uh, be getting very lucky and there doesn't seem to be uh, many googlies, but there is uh, lots of iron, which is very handy. So let's go and uh, light up this, uh, this tunnel a little bit and uh, let's have a little look down here. And oh, now there are googlies. Right, I can't fight. I can't fight with this character. It's just going to have to run away <laughs> and hide near the uh, the other one down here. And this is actually an amazing cave. I kind of wish uh, this was a, a mining challenge, to be honest, because look, there's emeralds and all sorts around here. Uh, this would be a lovely cave uh, if I kind of needed a good cave. But sadly, uh, all I'm after is a, a little bit of iron. So I guess I might as well grab my iron and then get out of here. So I don't need to worry too much about this one because uh, it's allowed to, to fight. Uh, but it does only uh, have a, a stone sword, though. So it's not going to be too powerful. And uh, that iron's quite hard to, to get. Uh, so let's go and get this iron. And I can see you. Look, he's hiding around the corner waiting to ambush me. But I can see you, zombie. Let's go <laughs> take him out. And uh, let's go and grab this iron. And then we can go and get back to the uh, the surface uh, because it's got to be nighttime by now. Uh, which means uh, there's going to be creepers uh, wandering around the uh, the surface and I need to try and gather uh, as much gunpowder as I can. Well actually I only need one bit of TNT so it's not too much uh, but yeah it'd be good uh, to get it uh, sooner rather than later. So I might go down here a little bit and uh, grab some of the uh, the iron from around here. I'm not allowed to place any torches though and it is very dark. I might actually have a, a little bit uh, to eat and if I did uh, find any diamonds uh, then that would be great as well. I could uh, also uh, make a, a diamond sword uh, which would be uh, make killing the, the creepers a lot easier uh, but it's not necessary. So how much iron do I have? I've got 24. As soon as this is uh, such a, a good cave I think I might as well just grab it a little bit more uh, just so I can make myself some iron armor because uh, then I'll be safer because I really want to make two sets of iron armor. <laughs> because I have two characters, uh, it's not going to be uh, enough just to, to make one. And it's not too necessary, uh, but any extra protection uh, would be lovely. And look, there's some redstone down here. Any more iron? Nope, just uh, a whole lot of uh, a whole lot of lava. Uh, so let's go and uh, have a little look around this way. Uh, just see if I can get one or two uh, more pieces of, uh, of iron before I head home. So where where have I gone to? I've lost the other meal. Here we go. <laughs> Just around the, the corner here. I'm going to find uh, one more batch of iron and then try and uh, make my way back to the, the surface. And then we can go and do some uh, some some creeper hunting. So uh, let's have a little look down here. It's a little bit dangerous sending this one first, uh, but I kind of want to just to put torches down. And there actually uh, doesn't seem to be any more iron down here. So you know what? Let's forget it. Uh, let's just go and uh, try and make our way uh, out of this cave and uh, back to the, the surface. I know I've at least uh, got enough iron to, to complete the, uh, the challenges. Uh, that I need to, uh, so I should be uh, should be okay. So I guess I'll just go. If I kind of just go one at a time and uh, try and make them get out of here. I think that's going to be a lot easier uh, than trying to do both of them at the uh, the same time. I just need to make sure I keep an eye on both of them just to make sure uh, that they are, they're both okay and all. 
Uh, I don't know if I've gone the right way. Was I supposed to keep going up the water? Aha, yeah, this is the other uh, water. Actually, it's kind of good. I can get out of this cave uh, very quickly. It's not been too much uh, of a challenge whatsoever. I'm just keeping uh, an eye on the, uh, the top screen at the, uh, the same time, because if he gets attacked now while I'm swimming up here, <laughs> it might be a little, bit of a, a little bit of trouble. So if I go and try and swim up to the, the water, uh, hopefully there's somewhere I can just jump off and stand on uh, without falling the, uh, the whole way back down. And uh, yes, it is night time. So that means uh, there are going to be googlies all over the place and I of course haven't smelted the iron yet so it's all well and good uh, having iron uh, but I can't actually do uh, anything useful with it yet so I need to go of course and uh, try and smelt it and uh, hopefully uh, something else that would be good uh, is to, to try and get some bones as well if I could get some bones uh, from some skeletons oh no I'm being attacked I'm being attacked oh no 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 oh no oh no okay let's try and get this one somewhere safe and then let's try and control this one right let's go and uh, oh look oh, there's a skeleton right there but I can't attack it right that one needs to move and then this one needs to go and try and attack the skeleton. Oh no, uh, fight me, not the other one. Oh no, I'm getting pushed back in the water. Right, I need to hide. I need to go and hide down here. This one needs to hide because this one can't fight. You go and hide down in the, the cave down here. <laughs> and then this one can go after the, the skeleton. There we go. That was a little bit dangerous. Right, let's switch this around then, shall we? Uh, let's go and send this one up first uh, to wait at the, the top of the, the cave. And then we go and send the, the other one after. It'd be good uh, to try and control both of them at the, the same time. But I think it would just be way too difficult. So let's go and uh, try and swim up uh, here. I'm going to have a little bit of uh, fish on my, my way up. <laughs> and then we'll try and get the other one out. This would be such a simple task if I didn't have to control two people at the same time. Let me go and uh, try and get that one to, to have a little bit of a, uh, something to to, to eat as well and uh, here we go there's a bit of a, a safe perch here uh, which I might wait on before going higher and then try and get the the other one up because I'm wasting time here uh, because it's night time uh, this is the the best time uh, to go after the uh, the creepers so I do want to try and get out of here uh, as quickly as I can so I should be a little bit more hidden now the one at the the top is anyway uh, just so I should be a little bit safer so uh, what I'm going to do is once I got them both up to the the surface I'm going to try and get back to the, the house uh, so I can start smelting the, the iron. But it's going to be a lot more dangerous now because there's going to be googlies uh, everywhere. It's going to be a lot harder uh, than it even was heading here because i got to control both at the, the same time while avoiding the googlies and with only one of them being able to fight. And the one that can fight has only got a stone sword anyway, so it's not going to be that powerful. Uh, but at least I have made my way uh, out to the, uh, the surface. So at least I'm not stuck down in the, uh, the cave anymore. So uh, this one can put some torches down uh, to, to light up the other uh, way and uh, then we can go and grab the the other one so there doesn't seem to be any googlies right at the top oh i can see a uh, skeleton a little bit in the the distance but we should be uh we should be okay right this is going to be challenging. <laughs> uh, but if I do see any creepers uh, on the the way home, I think I am going to go for them. I think it's I think it's four pieces of gunpowder uh, you you need uh, to to get TNT. Uh, but of course, creepers sometimes uh, drop more than one piece of a uh, uh, TNT at a time. Uh, but sometimes they don't drop any, so it's a little bit of a risk reward. But now, I just need to remember. Where did I come from? Which direction? I think it might have been this direction, the way the, the bottom screen's heading in. But there is a, uh, a skeleton. Oh, yeah, there we go. I can see the beacon. <laughs> it's right there in front of me. All right, so let's go. In. Oh, oh, there's a creeper. Oh, there's a creeper attacking this one. I'll save you. No, no, I'll save you. Attack me, creeper. Attack me instead. Attack me instead. Oh, no, no, no. Don't blow up. Don't blow up. No! <laughs> I sent him flying. I sent him all flying. Oh, no, he's hurt. He's really hurt. Right, let's go and take out this, uh, this skeleton, shall we, with this one. <laughs> then let's get this one to have a golden apple and then let's get home shall we let's get home uh, as fast as we uh, as we can right i've well, got some bones and uh, an arrow as well there uh, which is going to be helpful uh, for taking out the uh, the creepers actually having a, a bow and arrow so that might have actually uh, ended up uh, quite good uh, but now uh, let's try and uh, get home uh, as fast as we can all right i'm trying to to watch both screens at the the same time uh, to try and guide them uh, so i can get home uh, as quick as i can and uh, it's pretty slow progress but <laughs> at least i am moving them at the uh, the same time uh, so then that way uh, they are able uh, to, to stick together so there we go we got over the the hill and I'm also uh, keeping an, an eye out for for creepers I did see some zombies and some skeletons uh, so let's go and try and uh, veer a little bit uh, to the uh, the left if we can and then that way we can hopefully uh, avoid them and uh, try and get back to the uh, the house uh, so we can try and uh, start getting some of the the iron smelting and oh I can hear a zombie coming behind me oh, I need to remember to jump keep jumping oh I'm getting hurt All right let's try and get them to sprint shall we and oh there is a creeper over there as well. Right, let's try and sprint. Oh no! Oh, one's getting hurt. The bottom one's getting hurt. Oh no! Creeper! 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 Oh! 
This one is not having much luck with Creeper. And oh, this one is getting hurt as well. Well, let's go and uh, have a, a golden apple because uh, I'm getting really hurt. And oh, I can see Squid Nugget. I saw Squid Nugget run past uh, on one of the uh, the screens there. Hello, Squid Nugget. <laughs> um, hello. Where, where, where's he gone? I'm getting so confused between all these different screens. Oh, no. Oh, no. I fell down a hill. I fell down a cave. Oh, and this one isn't allowed to, to break blocks. So, oh no, this one can't place blocks. So I can break blocks uh, to, to try and uh, get out this uh, little cave and to uh, try and get back home. I'm not having much luck with these creepers. They're always attacking the wrong one. <laughs> They're attacking the one uh, that can't fight back. And oh no, there's another zombie here. Luckily, this one's uh, allowed to, to fight it. And hello, Squid Nugget. I don't know what Squid Nugget's after. Oh, he's got all iron stuff. He's got an iron sword. I reckon he uh, is going after creepers already. So let's try and avoid some of these cactus and uh, try and get back home. I want to uh, try and get one of them uh, home safe uh, so the other one can go and do uh, all of the uh, the fighting. So there we go. I've got one in the, the house. Uh, so now I can just focus on the, the other one. And I'm going to leave the uh, the bottom one uh, at home looking after the, uh, the iron. Uh, while the, the other one uh, goes creeper hunting. And I can see there's a skeleton waiting here. Uh, so let's go and uh, take out the uh, the skeleton uh, so I can get the other one home safely. Right, let's go, 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 go. Let's try and get both of them uh, inside if we can. There's one inside and the other, just about. <laughs> let's go and shut the door. Have a little bit of cake. Nom, 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 nom. <laughs> and uh, let's try and get some of this uh, this iron smelting then, shall we? Uh, so I can go and throw all of the, uh, the iron in there. Uh, so that can go and be smelting uh, away. And uh, while that's going, uh, I am going to go hunting some of these creepers. So I've only got a, a stone sword, uh, so it might be quite difficult, uh, but I do have a, a bow and arrow as well, so I can try and get them weak a little bit with the uh, the bow and arrow, and then just try and finish them up. Oh, there we go. I was actually able to completely take that one out uh, with the, the bow and arrow. So I got, uh, I think I got two pieces of gunpowder there as well. That's, uh, that's pretty handy, but I'm now getting a little bit overwhelmed. This is good. Oh, look at them. There's creepers everywhere. This is actually really handy. I've run out now uh, of, uh, of arrows, so I can't shoot anymore, but there we go. There's a Another bit of gunpowder down here. If I can go and grab this without the others blowing up. There we go. That's three pieces. I believe I only need one more piece now. Oh, they all blew up. <laughs> oh, look, there is some gunpowder down here. There we go. I got five pieces of gunpowder. Sorry, Squid Nugget. You were too slow. <laughs> all right, let's go now and uh, try and uh, get the uh, the iron. I think I have all the, the gunpowder. Uh, that I that I need. So uh, let me go and grab some of this iron and I can go and start doing some crafting. So uh, I need uh, to make some shears and uh, also need uh, to make uh, the... Um uh, the mine car as well. So I'm going to go and uh, get all that done soon once all the iron has melted. Uh, but sadly, uh, we've just about run out of time in this episode here. Uh, so I'll leave a link in the description to the next episode of the Double ch uh, double Trouble Challenge <laughs> once it's online. But for now, I want to thank you all very much for watching and I will see you all later. Bye!